Hello, once again, I'm Steve Leto. We're going to take a walk around a cool car. This is a 1963 steam-powered Volkswagen owned by Tom Kimmel. Originally built by a group of nuclear engineers out of Oak Ridge, Tennessee. They called themselves the Mobile Steam Society. The thinking was that uh, we could build a car like this and perhaps eliminate smog, which was a big deal back then. So uh, it's painted orange in honor of the uh, University of Tennessee. And in the back, besides that gigantic steam generator, is a Hearth snowmobile engine, a three-cylinder engine. It was two-stroke originally. They converted it to work with steam. Now, the car is plated and legal to drive because it does run. Uh, we're not going to get to drive it today, but we will one of these days. Uh, and um, they originally had a Stanley Steamer engine that they pulled out of a Stanley Steamer and took those dimensions and measurements to create this particular steam generator and they found out it would fit in the back of a Volkswagen they did that and then of course where do you put the condenser because the car had no radiator and so they put the condenser right here <laughs> makes sense if you're a nuclear engineer uh, and uh, those plexiglass ears on the side help direct the air over the hood up the windshield and through the uh, condenser which then turns the steam back into water and cycles it back into the system that of course is how a steam engine powered car works and of course from the front if you can ignore that condenser it looks just like any other 1963 Volkswagen but this one of course is powered by a steam engine we'll take a look inside of it of course uh, we'll open the door up here and you notice that the door looks just like a door off any other Volkswagen but that's where the similarity ends because as you lean into the car you'll notice the back seat is gone and filled with steam stuff including that gigantic steam generator and other tubes and wires and controls and piping and things of that nature. And then, of course, the dashboard's taken over with scientific controls, timers, switches, knobs, buttons, and uh, dials, condenser, a couple labeled fire, <laughs> which, of course, you need to create your steam starter, oil, uh, steam condenser, and feed water. And, hey, there's a speedometer in the middle. I wonder how fast this thing goes. Well, we'll find that out later. This car does run and drive. When Tom got it, it didn't, but he got the uh, engineers to come back out and visit his shop and help him get it running. They did get it running. Uh, couldn't drive it today, but one of these days, shortly, we will. And when we do that, I will bring along a camera and film it for you, and we'll talk about that as well. By the way, the uh, engine cover is just sitting on a bench behind me. We just took that off to get a better view of the innards of the car. Hope you enjoyed it. That is the 1963 steam-powered Volkswagen owned by Tom Kimmel. Thanks, Tom, and I hope you enjoyed it. Bye-bye.